October 4th, 1991. We're getting ready to start work on the house and we're beginning to strip the topsoil off. There's Terry and Scott in the uh, Cat 950. Quite a bit of good topsoil on here. We're gonna go up and take some shots. Looking around the lot, not a lot to see. There's the uh, track hoe, which is down parked, and the kids off uh, playing on the trailer with their bikes. There we go. Didn't have the uh, proper thing on to focus. Anyway, so they're having a good time down there. Bradley and David are starting to take the fence down. Let's go back over here to the action. Cat. Quite a bit of soil there to push. Get run over. Unless he gets out of the way. So anyway, now it starts. I met today with the builder, and uh, we got the building permit, and we're getting ready to start. We'll probably dig the basement a couple days from now and uh, get going. We'll try to get this recorded all on film. Bradley, he's digging out some fence posts that were in the front of the property. Let's see if he can get it out without squashing the post. Great operator here. He's a little close to the post. There he goes. All right. Did it. Okay. Good job, Brad. There's Ricky in this thing with him. Three again. We got Brian back there somewhere in the back. I'm not sure where. A lot of thick topsoil coming off of this. We've started working on our basement, here we are in our lot, and there's Terry over there digging. We've got the, the uh, topsoil stripped off, and the basement footings are dug around the outside edge of the basement. Now Terry's just starting on the basement itself. And he's got our track hole. That thing throws a lot of dirt. There's Brian looking down into it. Brian's king of Bunkers Hill. He got his lip cut. And what else happened to you, Brian? Um, I can't <laughs> Let's see your teeth. <laughs> He's got quite a gap there in his teeth. It looks like the digger dug them out. <laughs> that digger has got a four foot bucket. And it's just digging through this dirt like nothing. Okay, we'll come back and get some more pictures of this later when he's gone a little farther. But it's all staked out. You can see the stakes. Don't, Brian. See the stakes around the lot. So anyway, we're underway. There's our van out in front. There's Terry and Jenny in the van in the uh, cab.
Ricky digging our basement. Ricky's in there. He's digging like crazy. Let's see how he does. It's starting to take shape there. This is where the uh, utility room is going to be. We'll jog out from the kitchen. Hi, Jenny. Do you know where Brian is? Oh, there he is. Oh, uh, Rick didn't get much dirt. Guess he'll have to try it again. Five now. Brad? Hi. Josh. And uh, we're making some progress. Terry sitting over there, Biggie and Scott sitting on top of the cat. This is a real hot item there. David's down there taking shots down the hole from the uh, laser leveler over there. Hanson. He's, he's the guy that's gonna <clears throat> make this thing perfect. <laughs> he's a builder, and there's Terry. <clears throat> we got a picture of you You're taking a picture of us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. We got Brad trying to dig here. Take all day. Hurry up. Bradley obviously doesn't know what he's doing, so. There goes Scott trying to so. I just hope he doesn't get the trap. It's strange. It's a nice day. Scott left. Well, what does he do? Is he moving his mouth? He's always been there. of October 1991 we just got back from Lake Powell and it's Sunday afternoon we just came over to check they finished our footings there's Brian down there walking around the footings and it's kind of how it looks they've started to stack their forms there's Brad they started to stack their forms around so they can pour the walls there's Ricky and uh, so it looks like they're staying pretty much on schedule Brian, how you doing? Good. Come on, Scott, stop throwing rocks. Right. There's Brad, walking around it. This will be the front room over in the family room. There's where the uh, fireplace is going to be. And down on that end 
is the garage. You can see we've got dirt stacked around. Terry made roads so the cement trucks could get around it. Here we are down inside the basement now. Got a wing wall dug out there so that when we uh, dig down, we'll be able to keep the dirt back. This is the walkout part of the basement. And a quick survey from down here. Say hi, Brian. Let's see those teeth. Where are they? Get it here. Are they growing in? Uh-huh. Good, okay. Would you guys stop it, please? Today's the 14th of October, if you can hear it from that stupid music that these guys are playing to set up our uh, walls here. There they are, setting up the wall so we can pour the basement. b and construction. It's just a wall, retaining wall, to keep the dirt back. What do you think of this? What? What do you think of this? Good. Yeah. Okay, when I put this down, I'll show you some of the uh, things that you should know about it. Um, this all dead. What? We're gonna pour cement inside those. And these are just take a them off. Yeah, okay. Come on. Remember 1981, they're in the process of pouring the foundation wall. And we've got a number of trucks from Geneva Rock. And uh, men pouring the cement, making sure it's the right height.
uh, 3.30 on the 15th of October. I picked up Brian from school and picked up Rick from, actually Rick got home from school, brought him with me and we came over to see the final result of them having poured the walls. So they finished pouring, we got steel sticking out. Uh, it will cure up tonight and tomorrow morning they'll strip off the forms and the walls will hopefully stand on their own. And uh, hi Brian. And we'll be able to start putting in the floor, put blacking on the outside to keep the water from going in, and uh, then we'll be able to backfill it early next week. So, let's go inside, Dad. We're going inside. No, there's nothing really to see inside. Yeah, that's today is October 16th, 1991, and the, the foundation was poured yesterday, and today they're taking down the forms already. So you can see the braces where the windows and the doors were. Day on the 16th of October and they have finished stripping the forms off although they haven't hauled them all away and we came over to take a look there's Brian just out of school walking on the wall let's get a close-up of him your teeth still missing Brian yeah. we didn't get the other boys because I had to come over and meet the builder to get signed up for the gas service we're gonna run the gas line in on the west end and anyway here we are I'm gonna go over and then go down into the uh, excavation and take a look at the vault door. With a view. Well, let's go over and take a look at our vault. Side and there's our vault door. It's all cemented in. This is inside of our storage. And walking around, this is Scott's room here, his window. And there's going to be our guest room right there. This will be where the downstairs bathroom is. And here's going to be Bradley's room where it jogs out. He's going to be able to look out the walkout. And here are the footings along the outside of the downstairs family room. And this will all be filled in with dirt and then that will be the exit right there where the windows are. And then here's the inside and the footings for underneath the fireplace and this will all be filled in. And there's Brian again trying to come down and get in. Sneak inside. Okay, so that ought to do it for uh, the video record of this part of the... Today is Tuesday, October 22nd, 1991, and Terry's beginning to backfill our basement. We're supposed to use the uh, track hole, or the, uh, not the track hole, but the uh, 950 wheel loader, but Sam's not here with it yet, so he's gone ahead and started with the track hole. You can see he's climbed down inside over the wall. And he's putting dirt inside so that uh, they can begin the under slab work. And so looks like I'm, my battery's low, so I'm gonna have to go charge this thing up. But uh, well, at least we've got some pictures of the work beginning to backfill the basement, and we'll get some pictures later on.